Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Serengeti Medium Aviator Sunglasses. So, you guys have been asking me to do a review over a pair of Serengeti sunglasses forever, and today is finally the day we are getting to review them. So, first off, let's talk about the dimensions of these sunglasses. They have 59 millimeter lenses and a 13 millimeter bridge, and what's really interesting about this pair is they have these beautiful gradient lenses. So as you can see here at the top, they are darker, and then they progressively get lighter here towards the bottom. But that's not the only cool feature of these lenses. These lenses are also photochromatic, which means that when you're wearing a pair of sunglasses, indoors they're going to be lighter, and then when you walk outside into direct harsh sunlight, the sunglasses actually get darker. So lenses on this particular pair have Serengeti's driver's lenses, and that has this beautiful brown tint to them, and they are absolutely great for driving with those photochromatic lenses that darken and really help reduce the eye strain when driving. These are not polarized, and that's because this particular pair is really meant for pilots, and pilots would not want polarized lenses because it would actually mess up their digital screens that are all over the cockpit of the airplane. But of course, if you do want a pair that's polarized, they definitely do sell polarized versions of their sunglasses. This one in particular is not polarized though. So kind of like Ray-Ban and Maui Jim, these sunglasses have a Serengeti logo here in the top right corner of the lens for authentication purposes. And if we take a look at the outside temples, they also say Serengeti there for authentication purposes. Now if we take a look at the inner right ear rest, they say made in Italy, and that's really nice to see that they are indeed still made in Italy, and the build quality is just really, really nice, just like you'd expect from an Italian pair of sunglasses. What's really cool about these sunglasses, opposed to the Maui Jim Mavericks or the Ray-Ban Aviators, is the fact that these have spring hinges. So if your face is a little bit bigger than standard and normal Aviators are just a little bit too uncomfortable here on the temples of your face, you might might want to check out these because their spring hinges bend out just like this and allow these sunglasses to give a custom fit to anybody's face. Now speaking of Maui Jim and Ray-Ban, I actually have those two pairs of aviator sunglasses right here. So here is a pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses so you guys can get a good idea of what these look compared to the Serengeti. And then here we have a pair of Maui Jim Mavericks, again they're classic aviator style sunglasses and this is what the Maui Jim Mavericks look like. So you guys can definitely tell tell that these uh, Serengeti sunglasses also do look very good and they all do look similar because they do have those pilot shaped uh, teardrop lenses. So of course they're going to look very similar to each other. What's really interesting about these Serengeti sunglasses though is their price. They're usually going to be, you know, $30 cheaper than a pair of Ray-Bans and I believe that would make them about $170 cheaper than a pair of Maui Jim Mavericks. So there is quite a big price difference spread right here, but as far as actual quality goes, they are all pretty similar to each other. So what's also really nice about these is they have fully adjustable nose rests, so you can adjust these nose rests to your liking. And through the nose rest, there's a S logo, which is Serengeti's uh, little logo here. It's gonna be etched here in the metal of the nose rest for authentication purposes. I think overall, I'm very happy with the quality of these sunglasses. The frames are built very solidly and they have a beautiful finish to them. And then the lenses are very clear. Looking down them, I absolutely love the quality of these and those photochromatic lenses are very nice and very pleasing on the eye. And these are really great for driving. As far as pricing goes, I think these sunglasses are very reasonable. They're gonna cost you around $90 to $120. I was able to pick these up for only $90 on Amazon and I will leave a link in the description down below. If you guys want to check the sunglasses out on Amazon, they usually have the best deal on Serengeti sunglasses. But that's all I got for you guys in this video. Let me know what you guys think about these sunglasses in the comment section down below. I am definitely interested to see what you guys have to say about them. But that's all I got for you guys in this video. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.